Hi, in this video I'll show how to convert SAV file from IBM SPS into Excel. You can see on my computer I have a um, SAV file from SPS. I can open it into SAV Viewer. It's a free app, it's showing what is inside of in, in SAV file. And you can see we have uh, uh, cities, areas and some data. Uh, land square mile, miles and land square uh, land square uh, kilometers rank and some textual data. I can open it into um, IBM SPS statistics. Oh, let me show, open it again. But this this shows uh, open it faster and I can export into different format this table. But let me show you how it opens into SPSS. I can just drag file here. Yeah, and it opens. So I will be converting this file into Excel with application I will install from, from our website. This is my website. To find application, I will click on search and type SPSS. And I need this page convert SPSS file. And I will click SPSS to Excel to open it. And click on download button to start downloading process and wait until archive will be downloaded on my local computer. I will be recording more videos on uh, how to convert SPSS files into different formats. So if you're interested, please consider subscribing to my channel. We are waiting for archive to be downloaded on my computer. Yeah, let's try it again. Oh, we see um, it's, it's downloading. It just downloaded twice for some reason. So I'll click on SPSS to uh, download it archive. And double click on MSI Signed Archive to start installation and click on more info here. Now I'm getting the screen from Windows because I'm not registered publisher with Microsoft. You can see publisher unknown. So just click run anyway to start installation. Click on next, next install. Click on yes and click finish. And you can see application has been installed to my computer. I have a new shortcut on my desktop. Now let's close this. It just exit. Close. And double click on the shortcut to launch app. Now to convert a SPS file to Excel, I have to do three steps. In step one, we will select input files. I'll click on this button and select, I can select couple, let's select couple um, sub files. It's like band data and states. And they will be added as separate tabs into spreadsheets, like separate uh, spreadsheets into Excel workbook. So, um, after all files selected, I'll click on next tab. There are no conversion options here, so I click next. And on the final step, I'll click run to start conversion. And it's asking me for name location of the file. This name location is OK, so I'll click save. And it's saying that file has been saved. Let's go and open this file. I don't have a, I don't have Excel installed on my computer. I don't, don't need Excel to install to do this. But I have Excel Mobile. It's a free version of Excel which is showing what is inside of Excel file. I cannot, unfortunately, I cannot resize columns and, uh, and cannot change it. It's just basic app showing what, what is inside um, Excel file and it's also slow. Uh, let me open it second time. Oops, sorry. This is Excel as view where it's different. It's app that shows Excel files faster. But let's launch it again in Excel Mobile. Yeah, and you can see we have a, we have a two sets of tabs. First, we have a data, which is we have we added two files, right? So this is the first file, and this is the second file. And there is also prop uh, page. Prop page is uh, what is um, field types for, for this same file. So it contains uh, properties for every column. So yeah, basically we have we have imported our uh, exported our data from self file from SPSS IBM statistics to um, our Excel file. And yeah, basically that's it. If you have any questions, please leave them in comments below. Um, if you'd like to see more videos like this and more application like this, please uh, uh, like this video and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.